Hi friend, this is the rate I old monk and today I am with the Nokia 3.1 plus and we are going to do the unboxing of the device hand sound and camera features we will talk about this in later now here is the device it is a global launch in India right now and the device is not 3.1 it is 3.1 plus it will be less than 13,000 uh, and in the box what we are getting other than that is the sim card ejector tool there are some papers which include the user guide and the warranty card now talking about the screen guard or the uh, case protector there is no crest protector in the device unfortunately now we are getting a micro usb charging cable and uh, there is also earphones in the box which is a good part but these are the normal ordinary earphones what we have seen earlier also it has a mic and it comes with the 3.5 mm jack now coming to the charger, the charger comes with the 5 volt 2 ampere rating. So this is the ordinary charger. This is not coming with the fast charging support. So this is what we are getting inside the box. And these are the box content of the Nokia 3.1 Plus. Now talking about the device, the Nokia 3.1 Plus comes with a dual camera setup with LED flash. There's fingerprint sensor at the back and also Nokia branding written. It is an Android one smartphone. Coming to the bottom hood, we are getting the dual speaker grills and also there is a micro USB charging slot. So the device looks pretty much premium. It has a 3.5 mm jack on the top and also the noise cancellation mic placed on the top. Coming to the buttons, it has a power button and the volume rocker key on the right side. And on the left side, we are getting the two slots. So one slot is the nano slot only and there is another slot which comes with the nano slot nano sim card slot and a micro sd slot which is expandable up to 400 gb coming to the camera here you can see it has a metallic finish it comes with the dual rear camera led flash is there fingerprint sensor you can check it out the body is polycarbonate definitely in the front you are getting a nokia branding 8 megapixel front camera it doesn't have any notch it comes with the 6 inch SD, dis SD plus display, the display aspect ratio is 18 is to 9. So definitely it is not 19 is to 9, but uh, the display looks pretty much premium. And those who don't like the notch, especially like the 5.1 plus, if you want to go and alternate, definitely this is one of the smartphones you can go out. Now talking about the OS, it comes with the Android one OS, which means this is a stock Android OS experience. It has a FM also and it will definitely get the regular update and uh, you will get the Android Pie update very soon for this device and as you know this is a global launch so definitely few things are still unknown coming to the display I have already told you it is 6 inch SD plus display which is 18 is to 9 aspect ratio the processor is octa core processor which is MediaTek Helio P22 coming to the RAM it has a 3 GB 32 GB 3 GB RAM 32 GB internal storage and there will be another variant which will come with the 2 GB of RAM, 16 GB of internal storage. Coming to the camera, the rear camera is 13 plus 5 megapixel camera. Coming to the front camera, it has a 8 megapixel camera. Talking about the OS, I have already told you it comes with Android 8.1 Oreo OS. Coming for the battery, the battery has 3500 mAh, which is a powerful, but definitely it doesn't have a fast charging support. Now, it has a fingerprint sensor at the back and you can enroll it but one thing is missing is the face unlock so you are not getting a face unlock in the smartphone and don't expect it to get it roll out in a software feature as the google hasn't announced this and android one smartphone may not get any face unlock feature now talking about the fingerprint sensor it works pretty much smooth and it is fast definitely so here you can check it out now one more important thing of the device is the camera so talking about the camera we will talk about in a little depth here so the camera comes with 13 plus 5 megapixel at the back in the front you are getting an 8 megapixel camera here you can see there are some of the modes which are the photo mode video mode slow motion mode there is also time lapse coming in the smartphone and there is also manual mode live bokeh mode panorama mode now coming to the manual mode here the manual mode comes with the iso setting and it also gives you the exposure there is a white balance these features you can play it around with yourself according to your requirement there is also a square mode the square mode gives you a complete square picture which will be helpful to post the pictures on instagram there's a live bokeh mode don't get confused it is only the normal bokeh mode in the smartphone now going to the settings in the device the device comes with the uh, as i have already told you 13 megapixel rear camera is the primary one 
and the 5 is the normal one. In the front you are getting an 8 megapixel camera. Now going to the video setting, the video resolution is full HD, both the camera rear and the front can record up to full HD video. Now talking about the samples, we have tried and tested this is normal rear camera shot, this is the bokeh effect, definitely you can play with the aperture and this is the front camera using it, I have played with both the bokeh mode and the normal mode, you can check it out how it looks. So this is all we have got with the Nokia 3.1 plus, the box pricing for the 3GB, 32GB variant is around 12,500 which I think will be around 11,000 and uh, the 2GB will be around 9,000 or something but this will be definitely coming nearby the Nokia 5.1 plus which is coming for 10 triple nine. so this is what we are getting with the device this is at the rate I will move signing off please like the video share the video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button below for us